Hey guys, it's Arnuf. Today, let's talk about routing. Now, when I was introduced to this concept, I was 12 years old and I was fascinated by the abilities that my device unlocked after routing. In this video, let me guide you through my top 5 things you can do after routing your Android device. Let's get right into it. So the first thing we can do is change the boot animation. It is the animation we see on our phones when it is turning on and we can change it after rooting. For this we need a .zip file and I'll drop a sample one down below. We need to use a file explorer such as ES file explorer and grant root permissions. Then we have to go to the downloads folder, copy the boot animation zip file and paste it in system slash media. Then we need to rename the boot, old boot animation to boot animation .zip dot old and rename our new one to boot animation dot zip now when we restart our phones we will be greeted by our brand new boot animation after routing we can also delete bloatware bloatware can be permanent system files which we don't want and are occupying unnecessary space to do this we need to install system app remover on our device and grant it super user permissions from here we can delete the system apps we find useless. Now you might be familiar with the term overclocking on PCs. Android phones can also be overclocked after routing. Now there are many apps out there which get the job done but I recommend CPU Tuner which is the most user friendly. Beware that overclocking above a certain limit can damage your hardware permanently so do this at your own risk. A simple overclock of 200MHz can boost your device's performance without majorly affecting the battery life. If you're not happy with your phone's UI and tired of changing small things from time to time, you can install a custom ROM. Now many guides are present all over the internet to flash one on your respective device and the processes may differ from phone to phone. I would recommend going for a well-known and official ROM build as they won't mess up your phone. These would be Resurrection ROM, Lineage OS, or AOSP. Happy flashing! The last on the list is Advanced Battery Saving. With root permissions, you can install apps which can gain extended controls over others in order to save battery life. Greenify is an excellent app, and while it works without root, the root mode lets you take advantage of the full capabilities of the app. The app has helped me increase my phone's battery life by more than an hour. So that's pretty much it for the video guys, make sure to drop your feedback down below in the comment section. This is me Arno signing off and I'll catch you later. Peace.